practice reading the words with me to prepare for your spelling test. To do a quick review for the spelling test today, I'm just going to go over the sounds one more time. So remember, A-W and A-U both make the ah sound. They both make ah, ah, ah. And the schwa that we were practicing makes the uh sound. Let me show you some examples. Lawn, like I mow the lawn, has an A-W. So I'm going to place it under A-W, lawn. Pa also has a W, so I'm placing it under a W. Ah, I have the word sauce. What's my word? Sauce. Sauce, I'm placing under a U. Sauce. And my word hunt. Hunt, I'm also placing under a U. Hunt. Notice how all of these words have the ah sound in them. Lawn, paw, sauce, hunt. But these have a W spelling pattern and these have the AU spelling pattern. Amaze has the a uh sound at the beginning but is represented by the letter A. Amaze. Alarm is also represented by the letter A, but I hear a uh, at the beginning. A uh, alarm, alarm. All right, make sure you have a paper or something to write on and make sure you have a pencil or something to write with. We're about to take our spelling test. And at the very end, you can type up your answers and you can also take a picture if you want. So you could do either of those things, put it on the jot form or comment it on Facebook. And parents, again, I'm gonna ask you that you please um, let them try their best. Uh, we wanna know how much they know and we wanna know uh, what they need to work on. If this is um, something that we need to spend more time on. So again, just let them try it on their own. You can sound it out with them, you can sound it out um, for them, uh, but try to let them uh, think about it on their own. All right, we're going to get started. Number one. Number one. The word is paw. The word is paw. Ready? Arm out. Paw, paw, paw. Paw, paw. Now I know I have this chart up here for you and if you see some helpful words that are going to help you do great on this test, then you're super smart for using your resources. So the word is pa, pa, pa. For example, the dog has small paws, pa. Okay, moving on to number two. Number two, number two. The word is straw. What's the word? Straw, ready? Arm out. Straw, straw, straw. Str, ah, straw. For example, I use a straw to drink my juice. Straw. Straw. Okay, I'll give you a couple of moments to finish that one up. Straw. All right, number three. Number three. The word is away. The word is away. Ready? Let's break it apart. Away, away, away. A, w, a, away, away. For example, all my friends live far away. Away. Uh, 
All right, I'll give you a couple of moments. All right, away, a, uh, w, a, away. All of your words should have one of these spelling patterns. Okay, moving on to number four. Number four, number four. The word is afraid. The word is afraid. Ready? Let's break it apart. Afraid, afraid, afraid. A, r, a, d, afraid, afraid. For example, I'm afraid of the dark. Afraid, afraid. Oops, afraid. All right. And that one has a vowel team. When you hear that A sound, you're going to write two vowels that make the A sound. So just a little hint for you. All right, number five. Number five. The word is hawk. The word is hawk. Ready? Arm out. Hawk. 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 For example, the hawk has sharp claws. Hawk. Hawk. Okay, moving on to number six. Number six. Number six. The word is launch. The word is launch. Ready? Launch, launch, launch. O, A, N, C, launch, launch. For example, I like to dance during lunch. Lunch. And there's a digraph at the end. Lunch. 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 All right. <laughs> number. We're going to move on to number seven. Number seven, number seven. The word is faucet. What's the word? Faucet, ready? Faucet, faucet, faucet. Faucet, faucet. Faucet. For example, turn on the water faucet. Faucet. A et faucet. Okay, moving on to number eight. Number eight. Number eight. The word is cause. The word is cause. Ready? Arm out. Cause, cause, cause. K -a -z. Cause. K -a -z. Cause. For example, be the cause for someone's happiness. Cause, cause. Okay, I'll give you a couple of moments to finish that one. Okay, moving on to number 
nine. Number nine. Number nine. The word is amaze. The word is amaze. Ready? Arm out. Amaze. 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 A m a z amaze amaze. For example, the little girl is amazing because she draws really good. Amazing. Oh, but your word is just amaze. The root word amaze. Uh, mm, a a maze. All right, I'll give you a couple of moments to finish up writing the word amaze. Okay. All right, getting ready. Number 10. Number 10. Your word is vitamin. Your word is Vitamin. Ready? Arm out. Vitamin, vitamin, vitamin. V I T A M E N. Vitamin. Vitamin. And that is a long word, so if you're having trouble, we can clap it. Vi ta min. Clap it again. Vi ta min. So I broke it up into syllables. So the first syllable I hear is vi. V i. The second syllable I hear is ta. T a. The third syllable I hear is min. M e n. Vitamin. Vitamin. For example, fruits and vegetables have lots of vitamins. Vitamin. All right, if you haven't finished yet, I would pause the video right now so you can finish up all of your words. Make sure you didn't miss any. You can go back to the video and hear the words that you missed. And I am about to show you the correct answer so you can check your answers. But when you put your words on the job form, I want you to put them just like they are. Just how you wrote them is fine. Okay. All right. So here are your words. Number one, the word was paw. Two, the word was straw. Straw. Three, the word was away. Away. Four, the word was afraid. Afraid. Five, the word was hawk. Hawk. Six, the word was lunch. Lunch. Seven, the word was faucet. Faucet. Eight, the word was cause. Cause. Nine, the word was amaze. Amaze. Ten, the word was vitamin. Vitamin. All right, guys, I hope you guys did wonderful. I can't wait to see how you did. I know we've been practicing that all week. All right, see you next time.